Hello everyone, I'm your host Luke. Welcome to the Virtuous Cynic. I finally picked my channel name. This is kind of like an art style vlog. And yeah. Um, so, over the past three years, um, I had another YouTube channel. And, uh, long story short, I took that one down and decided to start over. And, uh, I covered aliens, I covered, um, <laughs> alien abductions, paranormal activity, political, theater, you name it, I covered it. Um, so, <laughs> I'm not going into this channel, uh, having to learn all the intricacies inwards and outwards of YouTube, right? So, uh, I just like to list really quick what I need, um, for this new channel. Um, and I'm going to be hiring out for this, so, yeah. Uh, I need a new intro. This was my channel's old intro. A new art channel avatar. Uh, I need to make a new end screen or have an end screen made for me. And I also want a new artist for the channel, which for from time to time, I would like to bring on as a guest and uh, hire them from time to time for artwork for a uh, video, you name it. Um, so, since in this video, uh, time lapse vlog, uh, <laughs> I am drawing a gray alien. I'd just like to give you a brief overview of what I believe is the structure for the alien society, um, culture, plan, whatever. Um, so, I believe that there are uh, three or four main races of aliens. The greys, the insectoids, the reptilians, the blondes slash nordics. Um, and hybrids. Hybrids obviously are a... Cover a wide range of alien sightings and... I can go into that in a different video of all the different kinds of hybrids that people see. Um, the insectoids are known as the overseers and they look like praying mantises. So I believe they are the ones orchestrating behind the scenes in the alien abduction phenomenon. Uh, they control the greys, they use them as pawns. Uh, if you look at a lot of depictions of greys and talking to alien abductees, experiencers, they don't have emotions, they don't wear clothing, so we see no re reproductive structures on the greys. So how would they reproduce if they don't have any reproductive structures, right? Um, the reptilians, uh, supposedly they live underground, you know, Dolce based, blah, blah, blah. Um, I'm not the biggest believer in reptiloids, reptilians. They don't show up that much in abduction encounters. Um, and the last one, Nordics, the blondes, um, they seem to be working independent of the insectoids and greys. Kind of interesting there. Um, a lot of their sightings are in South America and to people that are not 
I'll say, of European descent, it seems like. I don't know their purpose. I don't claim to know their purpose. Um, so, long story short, I believe gray aliens are drones sent out by the insectoids. And... That's, I guess, all I'll cover from my perspective on that. Um, so, I came up with the channel name, The Virtuous Cynic. Uh, checked YouTube, there's no channel name for that, so, or no other channel name for that, so... I'm going to use it. I like the sound of it. I ran it by a couple people and they liked the name too. So yeah. Um, what do I cover on this channel? Uh, gaming content. Philosophy, aka talking about religions that I find fascinating. Uh, Jehovah's, Mormons. Uh, different branches of Christianity. Um, I grew up Catholic, so I feel way more safe and or, uh, comfortable covering branches of what I, my faith was raised into, or what I was raised in, so yeah. Um, art vlogs, time lapse, where I just kind of want to talk. Um, and then kind of cult-like beliefs, like, uh, Heaven's Gates, uh, uh, there's a more recent one called Love Has Won, uh, just different, we'll call them cults or belief systems way outside of the quote-unquote norm and very few people subscribe to. Anyways, uh, this has been your host Luke. Like this video if you liked it. I hope to entertain more so make sure to subscribe and I hope you have a great day. Thanks for watching.